commissioners, the, the particular, I'm sorry, that's all right. 60. All right. Yeah, the item before you here is a request from the sheriff's office for a position reclassification. I do happen to have uh, uh, Captain Clifton here to uh, explain their particular desire, and I'll come back to the stage. reclassification because years ago when the position was uh, created it was a custodian and at the time their understanding was that it had to be certified uh, under certification from the state of Georgia. Uh, however, since I became captain we run into the issue consistently of when you read the law and what the law actually requires if they're assigned inmates and they're regularly supervised inmates they must be certified also by the state of Georgia. That's why we're asking for this position instead of being a civilian employee to become an actual certified officer. That way they'll have the necessary training in case they have an incident with the inmate or any problems that arise, but they will be working in population with the inmate instead. That's why we're requesting the reclassification. Any questions for Captain Clinton? Okay. Thanks, sir. Bill? I uh, just want to uh, point out uh, the uh, Support documentation that you received shows the difference in the reclassification cost for the remainder of this particular fiscal year. Uh, there's 12 remaining pay periods uh, to the end of uh, June 30th. Uh, we have estimated that the actual uh, budget adjustment for that will be $3,096.64. Um, you know, looking at the budget and the expenditures thus far this year, it, I believe that would be on top of what has already been budgeted. I don't believe there's available funding there to be able to absorb that unless it's located from a different area. Any questions, Mr. Beal? Yes, uh, Kevin. Um, in regards to the salary uh, study, compensation study that we did, uh, would this be comparable with it, with the new classification? And this is totally in line with the work that Condry and Associates did. Okay. Any other questions? Thank you, Mr. Beal.